Thursday, September 14th, 1 o'clock Mountain Time, 2017. You guys have all heard about Tampa Bay along the Gulf side of Florida, the bay draining prior to Hurricane Irma making landfall. And here is a photograph of people walking out in Tampa Bay that's normally full of water. Very unusual phenomenon. And people that lived there uh, were interviewed that had lived there their whole life had never seen that before. Um, I personally have never seen it before either. Um, Pensacola, it also did the same thing. Pensacola is up in the Florida Panhandle. And I just ran across this today. September 11th, as seen from Bayshore Condominium, I'm in Pensacola, Florida. All sand. The water disappeared. Pensacola, actually where that photograph was at is right there. Bayshore Condominiums, Pensacola Bay drained just like Tampa Bay did. Only a day later. And I'm going to take you in and show you something even more bizarre. It shows the effect on Google Earth. Just like the picture of the bay that the lady, or whoever it is, posted in that uh, article. Look. No water. Empty. There's a puddle right there. Gone. Looks just like that. There's the puddle. <laughs> There's the puddle. No water, Pensacola Bay. Google Earth, no water, Pensacola Bay. That's incredible. So it probably affected other places other than just Tampa and Pensacola. Um, but I had no idea that it would show up on Google Earth. That is absolutely incredible. Is it still like this today? Today's the 14th. This was um, observed on the 11th from that building right there that is incredible and guys I've seen I was in Hurricane Francis not only Charlie but Francis Hurricane Francis set out off of the coast and churned for two days off of the Atlantic coast of Florida right here we had 50 to 60 mile an hour winds for probably, well, I know when it passed over land, it was moving at about three or four miles per hour. And there were curfews back then during because Charlie created a big, uh, big mess. And then here came Francis. And it sat here with 50 to 60 mile an hour winds for probably two or three days. And I don't remember the bay draining then. And now I'm hearing of a bay draining up in Pensacola. And it's even on Google Earth. Go check it out. Thanks for watching, guys and be safe out there.